from service dogs and military animals to a canine that orbited the Earth. Here are 12 of the most amazing dogs ever. Hey, let's give a shout out or maybe a bark out to Hugo the dog, letting us know he recently subscribed to Epic Wildlife. Well, it is obvious that you have a nose for great content, Hugo, so thank you very much. Thanks for all that great canine support and cheers. Number 12, Greyfriars Bobby. The story of this Sky Terrier from Scotland is somewhat similar to that of Hachiko, who we'll get to later in the list. Now, Bobby's story was made famous in the 19th century when he was said to have spent 14 years guarding the grave of his owner, located at Greyfriars Kirkyard in the old town of Edinburgh. The dog became renowned for spending the rest of his life sitting there until he passed away in 1872. Bobby was later buried near that grave. Several books and movies based on the dog's life have kept the legend alive, and a commemorative statue of the famous dog is a popular tourist attraction. Smokey the dog. She only weighed about four pounds and stood around seven inches tall, but she made a big name for herself by serving in World War II. The Yorkshire Terrier was actually found in a foxhole in the jungles of New Guinea. After being purchased by an American soldier named Bill Wynn, she was credited with 12 combat missions and awarded eight battle stars. Wynn even credited her with saving his life by alerting him to incoming fire. She also gained fame by entertaining troops in military hospitals from Australia to Korea. After the war, Smokey became a celebrity and even had her own TV show in Cleveland, and she passed away there in 1957. Manx. This male German Shepherd was a rescue dog for Hungary's Spider Special Rescue Team. His speciality was locating earthquake victims who were trapped deep beneath the rubble. The dog was able to sense whether a victim was alive or dead and then alert rescuers accordingly. Manx and the team traveled around the globe taking part in rescue efforts, and he became famous in 1999 when he located a three-year-old girl trapped for more than 80 hours under the wreckage after the Izmet earthquake in Turkey. Two years before he died in 2006, a statue of Manx was built in his honor at the public square in Mishkoltz. Clone Dogs now, the Saka Republic in Siberia is thought to be the coldest inhabited region in the world, so it makes sense that any law enforcement dog dispatched there would have to be a hardy breed. Now, in fact, Russia is using dogs in the region that are genetically enhanced to sniff out explosives and drugs. Three Belgian Malinois dogs were used to clone these animals, and that breed is similar to the German Shepherd and is regarded for its keen sense of smell. Experts say the augmented dogs are more physically powerful than those conceived naturally. The animals are among some 500 puppies that were cloned and are said to be valued at around $100,000 each. Tang. In 1919, some 93 people were stranded aboard a ship called the Ethi when it became stranded after crashing into the rocks off the shore of Newfoundland. When a sailor tried throwing a rope to the people on shore, he was lost to sea. The ship's captain then gave the rope to a Newfoundland dog named Tang, who lived on board the vessel. With the rope in his mouth, Tang jumped into the water and swam for the beach. Once he arrived, the people there dragged the dog to land, then securely fastened the rope. Then, the rope was used to bring the remaining 92 people from the sinking Ethi. For his bravery, Tang was later awarded a medal from Lloyds of London. Cancer Sniffing Dogs Dogs have a sense of smell estimated to be around 100,000 times more sensitive than that of a human's. But did you know that dogs are actually able to sniff out cancer? Termed biodetection dogs, experts think these trained animals might one day help to revolutionize medical diagnosis. German researchers discovered that dogs could detect lung cancer from breath samples taken from afflicted patients, and dogs participating in the study were accurate more than 70% of the time. Experts think the dog's ability could help in detecting an early diagnosis of the illness, and it's possible that an electronic nose could be developed that would mimic the dog's ability to detect a so-called cancer scent, and that would help in making diagnosis of the disease quicker and less invasive. Bobby the Wonder Dog. This critter became known as the Wonder Dog after traveling more than 2,500 miles to track his owners from Indiana to Oregon. 
In 1923, the Collie English Shepherd Mix was on a road trip with his family when the dog became separated from them while driving through Indiana. The family conducted an exhaustive search for the pet, but eventually gave up and returned home to Silverton, Oregon, never expecting to see Bobby again. But six months later, he appeared at the doorstep, mangy and scrawnier than before, and showing evidence of having walked the entire distance all on his own. During his grueling journey, Bobby crossed thousands of miles of deserts and mountains during wintertime, averaging around 14 miles per day. The story resulted in a meteoric rise to fame for the dog, and he even played himself in a 1924 silent movie. Sergeant Stubby. While it's still unknown as to whether he was a Bull Terrier or a Boston Terrier, one thing is for certain. The dog was indeed a rare breed, and he served in World War I and even gained the rank of sergeant. Named for a short tail, Stubby was found by members of the 102nd Infantry while they were training at Yale University. After one soldier adopted him, Stubby was smuggled aboard the troop ship to France, and he ended up fighting in nearly 20 battles over 18 months alongside the 102nd regiment. The dog was said to boost morale, could locate injured soldiers, and alerted his unit when to take cover. Stubby even assisted in liberating a French village from the Germans, and he captured a German spy by clamping onto the seat of the enemy's trousers and holding him until U.S. soldiers arrived. Afterwards, Stubby became the only canine to be promoted to sergeant through combat. He became a celebrity after the war, meeting several presidents and leading parades around the U.S. The sergeant died in his sleep in 1926. Hachiko. This dog's name has become synonymous with loyalty and fidelity in Japan and all around the world. Hachiko was an Ikita Inu who would meet his owner at Tokyo's Shibuya train station every day after work. That routine continued until 1925 when the owner died at work and never returned. But Hachiko returned to the station every day, at the exact time his owner was expected to appear. The dog continued his vigil for more than nine years and nine months. During that time, news of Hachiko's routine had spread and people would drop off food and treats for him. By the time he passed away in 1935, Hachiko's faithfulness had become legendary and it became a Japanese symbol of loyalty. Many tributes can be found to him, including a permanent display at the National Science Museum in Tokyo. Balto. This Siberian Husky was hailed as a hero after leading his dog sled team through blizzard conditions to deliver a life-saving serum. When an outbreak of diphtheria hit Nome, Alaska in 1925, medical officials needed antitoxins delivered to stop a potential epidemic. The nearest supply of antitoxin was in Nenana, more than 670 miles away. But when extreme cold weather incapacitated other modes of transportation, it was decided to deliver the serum by using multiple dog sled teams. Balto was the lead sled dog during the final relay of the five and a half day emergency serum run. Conditions were so treacherous, the sled driver couldn't see, and he allowed Balto to lead the team without his direction. Upon arriving in Nome, Balto was celebrated for his accomplishment and became a celebrity. A statue was dedicated to him that stands in Central Park in New York. Dogs of War. Now, as you can tell from our list, there have been many canines that have served in the military, performing some amazing feats, or paws, if you prefer. Now, these days, many dogs undergo rigorous specialized training before being sent out into the field. And when you look at this picture, you nearly think you were looking at some sort of dizzying acrobatic act, or maybe the dog was photoshopped onto the ladder. But it's not a circus stunt or digital creation. The Belgian Malinois is undergoing part of the multi-purpose training that will allow the dog to join a small subset of canines known as MPCs, or multi-purpose canines. They'll often be deployed in special operations, including the Navy SEALs. Those animals will parachute out of planes or rappel down from helicopters. In the U.S. military, dogs have seen service since World War I, but in those days, the trained canines were often euthanized upon completion of the service. Now, they're adopted after the tour of duty has ended. Laika, the Spice Dog. In 1957, a canine cosmonaut made history when she occupied Sputnik 2, the Soviet spacecraft. When that vessel was launched into outer space, 
Laika, a stray female terrier mixed from Moscow, became the first animal to ever orbit the Earth. Now, while Laika was the first animal sent into orbit, the first animals actually sent into space were fruit flies that were launched by the US in 1947 aboard a V-2 rocket. Unfortunately, Laika passed away within hours when the satellite overheated. But the true cause of a death was not made public until 2002. Russian officials unveiled a tribute to Laika in 2008, and that monument featured a rocket along with a dog standing on top of it.